I'm Mark Greenstein of Ivy Bound. A lot of parents know that Ivy Bound has good tutors for academics, and they've enlisted us. Thank you. For those that haven't, I would like to give a why. Why use a professional tutor for academics? Number one is parents often can't themselves, either unwilling, feel unable, maybe just don't have the time. Number two, they don't have an online opportunity for a student that's working. Okay, there's plenty of things out there and Khan Academy generally is quite good. They have good videos, but it takes a well-directed student to march through a lot of videos. And there's still a, for some students, humbling, I didn't get enough out of it. I watched the video and still am getting things wrong. If you don't want to put your kid through that, that's frustration, it's extra time, that's a reason to look to a professional. Now here's another type. It's the older sibling, and I actually like this option, short of a professional or even at times better than a professional. Your four years older kid is back home from college or willing to do it online, been there, done that, maybe even with the same teacher from high school that the youngster has now. So knows the teacher's proclivities, knows what would impress the teacher. If your student is going to be looking up to that sibling and they're far enough apart in years that there's not going to be really a sibling bad rivalry, I think that's very healthy. And here's the final alternative, and I think this is the bad one, it's peer tutoring. They're not siblings, and they're usually close in age, just one year apart. And I think avoiding peers makes sense. Peer-to-peer -peer is often discomforting. Why is this kid so much better at chemistry than me? Peer-to-peer -peer can involve gabbing. Now, Peers who are employed by the school or directed by the school, they, they tend to act fairly professionally, but kids are kids, and they often gab out, oh, when I was tutoring Andrew, and Andrew doesn't want to be known to be tutoring. Sometimes the tutoring space is in a very known, prominent area in the first place, and that goes to the third reason for peer being dangerous. I don't like teachers knowing that my student's being tutored. There are incidents where teachers have held good grades, the top grades, away from kids that they know that have been tutored. Okay, so we like keeping that quiet. So what's the professional tutor got over all these? The professional is going to know concepts that are difficult. They've been used to seeing the same chemistry problem beating kids every year, and they have a solution. Often this worked for uh, prior kids. So the professional also takes away that personal mm, tension, but hopefully is personal, personable, and it's, the student can confide in that tutor. We expect you can do this with our tutors, please give us a try. Finally, a good professional tutor is typically a good buffer between student and parent. That there's some things that a student might bring up with a tutor that the student has a hard time bringing up with mom or dad. And professionals, at least with us, are trained to use empathy and care to get the point across back and forth, parent to student or student to parent, when they can't or aren't directly communicating well with one another. Um, we at Ivy Bound are an agency, and just in case a parent has a hard time telling something to a tutor, they can use us, okay? My staff in the office are going to be your conduits in case it's tough to say something to the tutor directly. I hope this gives you a good why for some of you to try. Try our tutors, that is. We won't disappoint. I'm Mark Greenstein.